Hey guys, Country Girl 555 here, Tina. Uh, I did want to report that my leg is feeling some better today, but still hurting when I get up and down on it, as long as I maintain a steady pace of walking. Um, I, noted, uh, I don't know if you notice or not that I walk in my videos. Um, the pace that I do through here, uh, roughly, it's like a little track, and I do this the majority of the day when I can't go outside or what have you. So I'm continually walking and that's what I mean uh, when I say my leg feels better when I'm walking. Uh, it's cold out there. It's snowing. It is. It's snowing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just a little flurry. A little bit of flurry. Uh, news update. My daughter calls me today and she says um, she was trying to give Cheyenne a bath last night. Guys, this is Friday. Cheyenne's supposed to come spend the night with me tonight. And I can't, I can't wait. Anyway, so. Uh, she calls and she says she was giving Cheyenne a bath. And she went to get up and she fell on the floor. Her back went out. Um, before I came over, she had a car wreck. And uh, she didn't go to the hospital. I told her that night, I said, Jennifer, you hurt yourself, you need to go to the hospital. A lot of times you're in shock or what have you, and you don't re really realize what's going on. So she, she went on to the hospital. She's been being treated with back pain ever since then because she was in some agony. She's been going to the um, physio and stuff like that. Well, uh, her back went out. They don't know what's wrong. Uh, they had to come get her in the ambulance, take her to the hospital last night, and... Um, she she doesn't sound well on the phone. She didn't sound well. She, she was in a lot of pain. Her mother-in-law, um, she, she was taking her to the doctor. They did an uh, x-ray, and the x-ray didn't show anything. So they were going to do another selected procedure, and I'm not sure exactly what that was. Uh, I think it might be a CAT scan, but I'm not 100% um, because it was such late in the day when the next appointment is. Uh, probably right around now, I think. She was at one earlier. Um, now I think, yeah, um, but she wasn't sure about an MRI, so it was conflicting between the two, the CAT scan and the MRI, and she was a little bit drugged up, woozy, so, um, and debating on whether to go to the next appointment, drugged up and woozy, because of being able to tell them actuality and where the pain was, so, yeah, my guess at knowing my back and how my pain is and how she described her pain to me I would about bet you money that she got a slip disc ouch 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 and ouch <laughs> so um, I guess we'll see to be continued on Jen I'm still cooking my pinto beans smells good in here um, I decided to have chicken breasts with them, so I've laid out chicken breasts to thaw out, um, which is, I didn't show you in my, if you watch my, uh, what's in your fridge video, uh, you didn't see my chicken, but I say that I have always got chicken in my fridge, so it's like a given, always a given, that I've got chicken in the fridge, so I just, I don't know why I opened my fridge to show you, and I didn't show you that I had, like, chicken, the Purdue Perfect Portions. Um, there's only four servings in there, fat-free, and for those that don't know, they come portioned out. They're vacuum-packed in vacuum-packed bags. So I'm calling out um, four servings for whoever is going to be here tonight. I'm not sure if my son's coming or not, but for myself, Kelly, Cheyenne, um, and if my son comes. Then, then that'll be there. But there's always, there's always chicken. Some Tyson chicken breast or some Purdue chicken breast or um, always chicken in my refrigerator. I don't care where I'm at. I can be on the moon and you'll guarantee me having some chicken up in that mug. Right, it's snowing in Tennessee, guys. <laughs> it's snowing like crazy. I love it. I don't know. Let me see. See if you can see. It's just coming down. It's 
of that lightly coming. It's a little bit more than it was a little while ago, but it's coming down. All right, I think that's all I wanted to say for right now. Um, Socks Heather. Eggs. I boil them, eat the whites because it's packed full of protein. Um, I don't eat the yellows when I boil them. When I, I'll scramble three egg whites and uh, a whole egg, or I'll scramble three and three, and I'll have nine, uh, 10, 11, 12 points uh, for our bowl of scrambled eggs. And that's, um, it's 75 calories per whole egg, right? So that's, you have to do the math, 75 times three and then 10, 10 times three. That's how many calories that is. That's one meal. Um, it's 12, what I say, how many points? Three, six, nine, ten. It's 12 points. Um, it's a meal for me. It's heaped, packed, jammed, smack dab full of protein. I also take and make egg white omelets with mushrooms, um, green peppers, and onion or chives or green onions, whatever. Uh, what else do I do with eggs? I put, I boil them, use the egg whites and tuna for the extra protein. Um, on the old plan, three egg whites was one point. So, in the old, in the old way of Weight Watchers, that bowl of scrambled eggs would only be ten points. Um, three, six, nine, and three whole eggs, and three egg whites be one point, so it'd be 10 points in the, on the old system. And then, guys, when I am, when I don't have all my stuff, I, I stick by the old system. I'll have my less points. I'll go back down to my, what points uh, I should have, which is 30. And I'll stick with the old system of Weight Watchers. I won't lie to you, that is what I'll do in a New York second because the old plan I know like the back of my hand. And I know if I don't do anything else, I'll eat right. Um, and I'll be on task with my points. I, I won't have the extra weekly points. I don't consider that part of the plan. I don't have them anyway. I don't even acknowledge they're there. I know that I get 49 extra points a week if I want to have it on beer, what have you, blah, blah, blah. But I don't even acknowledge it's really there. I don't count it. I don't use it. I don't even know. Um, I just kind of, I maybe I should. Maybe I should. Um, maybe I need to try it. Maybe it's what I need. Who knows? But uh, sticking with, if you bite it, you ride it. Not like before when I said ride it and uh, ride it and bite it. <laughs> bite it and ride it. Okay, guys. Uh, I've j I think I've done enough talking. <laughs> oh, I was going to say something else to you, but can't remember what that was now. So, um, oh, yeah, my lunch was good. The lunch was absolutely amazing. Um, the tuna was too salty. <coughs> I needed, which was a great reminder that I need to be watching my sodium. <coughs> I put the salt in the tuna. Why did I put salt in tuna? I have no idea. Why did I buy it in water, spring water, if I were going to add salt to it? Stupid, stupid girl. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, took my vitamins today. I've had two bottles of water. Sorry, three. Working on my third bottle right now. <coughs> no coffee today. I had too much yesterday. Um... Can't think of anything else to say at the moment as far as my updates go right now. That's it. <laughs> it's snowing. All right. I love you. Peace out. That's how we roll. God bless you guys.